What is worse than with, with, uh, the other thing is that Allah is telling you, uh, disbelieving in Allah, okay, is worse than killing one person, even though that killing is wrong. Ah, uh, you see, see, you you agreed with me right now. In other words, the threat of ceasing, the threat of ceasing being what, a Muslim. What is threat? What is what is disbelieving oh, in no, Allah? No, what, there, it's not no, about about in, in other words, in other words, if the environment the is eye, such, in in other words, in, in other words, yeah. in if the environment is in such a manner, okay. you will disbelieve in Allah. Then you have been asked to fight. Can a Muslim come and, come and defend Islam at all? So far, I haven't found any knowledgeable Muslim. Even the expression knowledgeable Muslim seems to be an oxymoron. And so no wonder our nation is seriously suffering today. My dear friends, our nation is suffering. Things are burning. You are a Muslim, sir. So you may, maybe can help us understand. Yeah. So clearly there are issues you know, across many cities today. Yeah. In the last few days, people are angry, frustrated in relation to Islam. You are aware of that. Okay. I genuinely think, yeah, well, I, I'm coming there. I don't there. know about the situation. You want to talk to me about religion? Yes, I don't Yeah, know religion, about... really. I want to talk to you about religion. You know, in, in, I am a Christian. Okay. According to Christianity, we have values. Deep values that we cherish. And I go through the Quran multiple times and I find none of these values here. Like what? Like, for example, love. Do you have God is love in the Quran? Yes. yes. Please show me. I, I know from my heart. I don't need to show you from this. No, no. You know you're from your heart so you can show it from here. Look, your heart is in the Quran. The Quran is here. Show me where is God is love. Love what? You Are you Muslim, sir? Yes, Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, please. So, yeah, yeah, please. You, please, if you please come here. Yeah, 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 sure. Yeah, yeah, sure. God is love. I'd like God, to find love, out... Love what? <laughs> well, what love, do you mean love what? No, no. God is love. Now, what does God is love mean? I don't... This, this phrase is not it's, understandable. It's, it's, it's his very essence to love. Okay. It's his very love, essence. Love anything? Well, of course. If he is God, you better does. So, this is why you... Do you think God... Islamic Allah... God, yes, yeah, yeah, sure. God loves... Yeah. Okay. God loves the Muslim people. That is one love. <laughs> God loves Muslim people. Even human beings can do. What silly thing is this? No, can what? I show you? Do you love your children? Yes, I love my children. Do you love my children? I, I don't know. So even a human being can do what you are saying. No, your children you love, my children love. you don't love. That's what Islamic Allah does. The question is not clear. What is your question again, please? I show you. Yeah, yeah, please. But if you, if you please come here, uh, trying to cover. Yes, so, ask me a question yeah. again. Please. So God is love. We're trying to find out if God... I now, free speech. Uh, you, you understand the expression free speech? Yes, I know. Yeah. Do you have any, any evidence of free speech in the Quran? Evidence of free speech in the yeah. Quran? Where someone has denied Islam and is led to live yes, when there Islam is, there had the... Is, there, is, there, is, there, is, there is, there is. There is in the Quran, the verse that says, okay, La ikraha fid din, which means, do you, do you understand that, La ikraha fid din? It means that you are not forced to follow a certain... Where, where is this? In Surah Al-Baqarah. <laughs> are you kidding me? You ask, Have you read the Surah Al-Baqarah? I memorized Surah Al-Baqarah. I don't good, need to read good. it. So Surah two, uh, uh, Surah Al Baqarah, Ayah two one six. Right. Yeah, read the whole context. Let's read the whole context. Warfare is ordained for you. Warfare, warfare, warfare is ordained for you, though it is hateful to you. But it may happen that you hate a thing which is good for you, and it may happen that you love a thing which is bad for you. So. They question you with regard to warfare in the sacred month. Say, warfare in its in it is a great, but to turn from the way of Allah and to disbelieve in Him and in the inviolable place of worship and to expel His people from there is greater uh, with Allah. For persecution is worse than killing and they will not cease from fighting against you till they have made you renegades from your religion, if they can. And who becomes a renegade and dies in disbelief, such are they whose works have fallen both in the world and the hereafter. Though, uh, so this, this, okay, so okay. please explain. Okay, please. First of all, I'll read it in Arabic, so you know that... No, no, no English is fine. To... No, we, we, English is fine. Okay, but... So far, we've read in English, English okay, is fine. But you... we agree with it. Okay, first of all, let's, let's explain this, okay? Yeah, yeah, please. You know, uh, for my Muslim audience, okay? كتب عليكم القتال وهو كره لكم وعسى أن تكرهوا شيئا وهو خير لكم وعسى أن تحبوا شيئا وهو شر لكم والله يعلم وأنتم لا تعلمون. This is the this is the ayah that you read in English. Okay. 
So what Allah but you, you haven't explained it, you just read it, okay? You didn't you didn't Excuse me, are you getting to the explanation right yes, now? I am, Please, but thank but, you. But you don't brought me, don't Okay, sorry. You brought up you brought up the the ayah, okay? Without even explaining why it's violent. Fighting, warfare. So any any okay. so any warfare, I can clarify any, if you want. I can clarify if yes, you want. Clarify. Okay. So you're saying that any warfare I, I, I'm violent. now clarifying. Okay, come Clearly on. you didn't understand English, I'm now clarifying. So, warfare, warfare okay. is ordained for you, okay. though it is hateful for you. Okay. What's wrong so, with that? as Muslims, okay. tell me what's wrong with that. Okay. Did you ask me to explain? Yes. Did I just begin? Yes. Don't, don't don't interrupt. Yeah. Unless you're panicking, please don't. So, the point the point is very simple, okay. which is across the Quran, like in Surah 532, Surah 929, and so on. We find the idea that Muslims have been asked to fight, have been, have been asked to fight, but please, we're trying to catch you, please. Muslim, Muslims have been asked to fight because they, the threat that they face is that they somehow would be disbelievers. That, that, that is the threat. If you go through the entire Quran, you will not be able to show me one evidence of someone who actually violently persecuted Muslims at all. The only threat that they face is that they will cease being Muslims. And at the face of this threat, they have been asked to fight and kill, kill unbelievers. So please tell me, in other words, in other words, if a Christian comes here in Speaker's Corner and tries to explain to a Muslim that being a Muslim isn't great, you need to cease being a Muslim, that will be seen as a threat and you will fight against me. This is Islam. Now, okay. now no, no. you tell me, okay. you very tell good, me, very good, is, very this, is this violent or not? No, no. Okay, very good. Now, I understand your explanation. So now, can I answer? Yes? You want the answer? You already began speaking. Okay, good. So what you're saying, okay, is totally wrong. First of all, we don't deny that there is fighting in Islam and that Muslims are allowed to fight, okay, in certain situations, okay? Okay, we're not denying that. It is all over the Quran and it's called Jihad Fi Sabilillah, okay? But what you're saying, you're not listening, you're talking, so you're... Yeah, I'm trying, I'm trying to make sure. Yeah. You, want to, you want the answer? No, you, 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 okay. You just con you, you concentrate with me now, okay? Okay. All right. Now this, now this verse in particular, this verse in particular, okay, that you read, okay, Allah is telling the Muslims that you are allowed to fight. How can I talk when you're looking the other way? Don't, don't worry. Your fellow, is that your friend? No, I don't know him. Is that your brother? I don't know him. Is that your Islamic brother? I don't know him. Is that your Islamic brother? I told you I don't know him. Are you listening to me? I didn't ask you if you know him. I don't him. know if he's a Muslim. I'm asking. He is a Muslim. Okay, if you okay. just ask him not to harass... No, just well, I can't him. ask him. I don't know him. Maybe we'll stop and start again, Ray. This is a good place. Please go on. Okay. Now I'm telling you that in Islam, you are allowed to fight, okay? To defend Islam. Yes. Okay, but what you're explaining that if any kind of, if you're facing any kind of threat as if like if you are against Islam or saying something against Islam that I'm allowed to kill you, is that what you understand from this verse? That's what the verse is saying. It doesn't say that. So show me, oh, show me what. does it say that anyone who disagrees with you that you are allowed to fight? What does that say? Okay, let's see. Yes, say. Please read this. But it may happen. Okay, the question with regard to warfare in the sacred month. Warfare in it is a great transgression, but to turn from the way of Allah. Huh? What is to turn from the way of Allah? Okay, okay, no, continue. What is to turn from the way of Allah? You read the continued. Continue. Okay, fine. You won't answer. Let me answer. Everything. That's fine. That's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll comment. So, if what are you, what are Muslims supposed to fight about or fight preventing something? You're, you're supposed to fight preventing the possibility that you will leave from the way of Allah. What is the way of Allah? Okay, wait, wait, wait. You said you're not going to explain. I am explaining right now. Essentially, the threat that the Muslims were confronting is that they'll suddenly not become, not be, not continue being Muslims. Not follow the way of Allah. And so, if you ever face the threat that you won't follow the way of Allah, you're supposed to fight back. In other words, you're not fighting because someone has attacked you physically, but you're fighting because someone is trying to convert you. Convert you. Okay, let me let me read. Let me read. Let me read. 
warfare in it. Why don't you comment? Why don't you comment? Why don't you speak to this gentleman? One second. Warfare. India doesn't recognize the Adivasis. Excuse me. Why does India? Are you a little bit confused right now? Are you a little bit confused right now? Stay, stay focused. Stay focused. Warfare in it is a great transgression, but, but to turn men from way of Allah. You see, you either fight or you turn from the way of Allah. So in other words, you either fight or you cease being a Muslim. That is the, that, those are the alternatives presented. And let me, let me continue. And to disbelieve in him. You see the threat, the sudden threat the Muslim faced. Whoa. Somehow you will disbelieve in Islamic Allah. How could one disbelieve in Islamic Allah? Someone could convince them that Islamic Allah isn't the are truth. Are you a question or you, you are an confused? Yeah, don't touch me, please. Okay. Okay. So, confused. the point... India is the nation of Aduwasi. Does he have a mouth? Yeah. He's the answer. Does he have a mouth? Thank you very much. Okay, let him speak. Yeah, cool. Thank you very much. So, you see the problem? I'd like you to... I'd like you to agree... I will answer. Let me finish and then you can. So, clearly, whereas you tried to change the verse earlier, the verse is very clear. You fight because you don't want to cease being a Muslim. You don't fight because someone attacked you. Now please clarify. First of all, the context of this ayah or this ayah, that verse that you have just quoted, okay? To understand it, you have to know why, why, the, why this ayah was revealed. Can I explain to you that? No, I want you to read the ayah, explain the ayah yes, first before that. going to any okay, context, now. please. The, the Quran actually said the question. So, yes, Alunaka and the Shahr al Haram. So, there is a reason why this ayah came down and was revealed. Yeah, where, where is that? Where is okay. that? Yes, Please. yes. Where is uh, what does yes, Alunaka mean? It means that they're asking the Prophet about the question and Allah is answering. Yeah, yeah. Okay? Yeah. So, what was the question? Can, yes, about warfare, warfare. No, no, yes, Alunaka and the Shahr al Sacred Month. Okay, so the question was here, okay, is that. Because according to the Arabs, at the time of Islam, okay, it was not allowed to fight in the months of, which were sacred. We have four months, okay, in the Arabic calendar, which fighting was not allowed. And it happened that during this time, okay, one of the Muslims had killed, had killed. Don't give me fancy stories. Stick with the context in the Quran. Stick with the context in the Quran. He doesn't want to so, okay, let, okay, I'll let you finish. I'll let you finish. Fancy then, Baba. Please, please. Okay. I'll let you finish. Let it is, me, is, please finish. Is, please finish. Yeah, okay. Please finish. Yeah. You, so you the answer. You lose your okay, time. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay. okay. Please finish. So now the, 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 the pagan Arabs were questioning Muhammad's integrity that you are claiming, you are claiming, okay, that you are not allowed to fight in the sacred month. Yes, one of, yet one of your companions had killed someone, okay? So this ayah is answering this issue, okay? So I'm not making up these things, okay? I'm okay. not giving you any stories as you're saying, okay? This happy. is the reality of sure, it, okay? Sure. Are you happy? So, why, why should I be happy? Sure, have you finished? No, I'm not finished. I'm okay, still go, answering. Go, go. He doesn't want to read okay. the truth. He just wants so to what the here. Quran is saying, okay, even though this act was a mistake, okay? But the other things that those pagans were doing are worse than this. What, what were they doing? Well, they, they, were not, they, they were disbelieving in Quran, which we call kufr, in, the, uh, in, in Allah, and they were fighting the Muslims. So this, this ayah, uh, this surah, this saddun an sabilillah means to fight and to prevent Islam from being spread. So the things that they were doing is worse than killing one person in the sacred month. So you people who are pointing fingers at Muhammad وسلم, and at his... Uh, 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 followers, okay, for killing one person, they were doing things that were worse than killing one person. They were killing multiple people who were trying to spread the word of Allah and the religion of Allah. Sure. So it's not about killing anyone just because they disagree with us. And if you want to understand that that is the concept of Islam, you have to read the, whole, the Quran in its whole context. And if you go to Surah Al Mumtahana, for instance. No, 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 I'm not okay. going anywhere. I, I want to. No, no, no. Wow, 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 wow. Let's stay here. Let's stay here. Let's stay here. Let's stay here. Surah Al Baqarah let, says, let, 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 Let's stay here. Let's that's stay here. That's why let's the Quran says in the same Surah, if you don't want to go anywhere else, okay, and you want to stay in Surah Al Baqarah, you can see that there is La Ikraha fi din qad tabayyan al rushd min al ghay. Faman yakfur bi taghut wa yu'min billah. Happy. Why am I going to be happy? So here is the problem, my dear friends. 
I think you're wasting you, time. I, Honestly, no, don't touch me. Don't, I've told you multiple times. You did touch me. Don't touch me again. Thank you. So my problem, my this, here is the problem. Where does it say in this verse that you're allowed to kill every single people who listen, doesn't believe listen, in yeah, what you yeah, believe yeah. in? Please listen. Now, now yeah. I'm responding. Yeah. yeah okay. So you you've given me a fancy story. It's not a fancy story. I'm, I'm, I'm speaking right now. I'm speaking right now. Don't don't I'm speaking right now. I'm speaking right now. That's the entire idea of speaking. When I speak, I'll contradict what you've said. That's the entire idea of speaking. If you like, please. So please. Don't say fancy. Okay. What's your problem, sir? What's your problem? You're not Are you confused? Just no, you Are man. you confused? You're confused. Look, your drink isn't doing you well. Maybe the toilet is there. If you're confused, yeah, maybe, maybe that's why you shake there. Okay. Okay. No, okay. Yeah. Coming to you, sir. So your, your, yeah. so your ideas, mm -hmm. you gave me a nice fancy story, in my view. And your, your idea okay. was that this surah, mm -hmm. this ayah says that Muslims are allowed to fight because apparently some Muslims were killed. That's your fancy story. No, you and I'm telling understand you, my story. Okay, let me finish. That wasn't what I said. Okay, can I now finish and then yeah. you can yeah. clarify, I'm add just, more I'm fancy to your story? You. I'm just correcting you because that's what, the, Look, that's what uh, I said. Uh, can I speak now and yeah. then you can? <laughs> thank you. Okay. Thank you, Rush. Thank you. Yeah. So, let's read the ayah carefully again and help us understand. Let's okay. let's try and understand. What is it saying? 216, Ayah 216, Surah Bakara, Ayah 216 says, Warfare is ordained for you. So, Muslims have been asked to fight. That's clear in 216. In Ayah 217, in Ayah 217, it goes on to say, They question you with regard to warfare in the sacred month. And then now, look at the comparison drawn. Say, this Islamic, the, 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 whoever this guy is who is receiving the verse, he's asked to say, say, warfare in it is a great transgression, but to tear, turn may, men from way of Allah. You see what the threat was? If you don't fight, they will turn you away from the way of Allah, which in other words means, in other words, it isn't saying, excuse me, in other, in other words, what it isn't saying, it isn't saying that if you don't fight, they'll kill you. Is that what it is saying? Was what is being said here? No. What is being rather said is very simply: if you don't fight, you will cease being Muslims. Why would a gentleman like him cease being a Muslim? He will be convinced that Islam isn't true. That's what will make him cease being a Muslim. So, yeah, sorry. Okay. Now I just. Now, so please no, tell me, no, sir, no, can, no. can you please for the okay, sake of no. my camera? No, 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 so you said uh, what, what, I, what I called okay. as fancy story. Please, okay. please start again. Okay. Sorry, apologies. Are you a Hindu nationalist? One minute, okay. Now you are refusing. You are refusing. One minute, please. How come Hinduism does not acknowledge other Muslims? Okay, I'm not into that discussion. Now, uh, now this guy here is not allowing me to go to another verse in the Quran to explain this ayah, okay? And if we go to another Quran in Surah Al-Mumtahana, it clearly explains the Islamic concept of fighting. So let's go to Surah Al-Mumtahana and get that verse and show you. But you're, you're not allowing me to go there because you want to stick to your explanation of this verse. So you explain. You I read the verse. I've already explained it. I've already explained No, no. Read the verse. Explain no, so to me. Do you read the part, from the verse, but to turn men from the way of Allah? Do you see turn, that? To turn the way... In Arabic, it's wasaddun an sabirillah. That is the, the, to turn the, the way of Allah. Okay. What does that mean? Wasaddun an sabirillah is to prevent people from guiding others to the uh, religion of Allah. Okay. Are you being a Muslim? Okay. Yeah, being a Muslim. Being a Muslim. So yeah, essentially, the threat but, but, is that you would be sorry, Muslim. Sorry, That's the threat. Wait, wait. wait so it's all, he's being a Muslim. Allah, Allah is making a, a comparison here. If you if you if you read it carefully, instead of telling me to read it carefully, look, you are the one who is ignoring the phrase. No, no, this. Not. There's a comparison here, which yeah, is being yeah. made between two things. Yeah. Allah is telling you that this is worse than this. What okay. is worse? Please tell me. Worse is the, in, is that you fight and kill rather than cease being a Muslim. That's you what it's saying. You the question and you're asking yourself. Go, go, okay. What is worse than with, with, uh, the other thing is that Allah is telling you uh, disbelieving in Allah, okay, is worse than killing one person even though that killing is wrong. Ah, you see, see you, you agreed with me right now. In other words, the threat of ceasing... 
The threat of ceasing being a Muslim. What is, what is, what is disbelieving in no, Allah? No, what, there, no, in, in, in other words, in other words, if the environment is such, in, in other words, in other words, in, if the environment is in such a manner, you will disbelieve in Allah, then you have been asked to fight. Is that, isn't that the right? Do you see anyone okay, so fighting Please you? explain to me. What's your no, argument? The threat, what is worse what's than what? Okay, okay, wait, please wait, listen. Wait, wait. What's your argument? I You're want to not understand. paying attention. No, no, I want to listen to you. Look, I want to understand. Don't touch me. I've told okay, you multiple I times. Understand. Now, if I you want understand. to understand, don't touch okay, me. That's the first thing to understand. Let's establish the don't question. Don't touch me. That's the first thing to understand. Thank you. Let's establish the question. What's your, me again. What's your argument? Yeah. That I'm Muslims want to kill everyone? I'm, I'm do you speaking. see anyone killing you? I'm speaking. Do you see many? Oh, do I anyone? see? Do I see any Muslims wait, killing wait, anyone? Where, where, do you see Hindus? Have Muslims you got? Have you got? I, I, have you got a problem with your eyes, sir? No, do you read the newspaper, sir? Answer, answer me instead of trying to. Okay, the gentleman asked me a question, and that's a sensible question to ask. He's asking me, hey, if this is true, then people must be killing others. Do you see Muslims killing others? All day long, you should just go through the newspaper articles, read about what's happening in Nigeria. Are you now afraid? Do you know what is happening in Nigeria? Do you know what's happening in India? Do you know what is happening in Somalia? In other words, you are, you asked me a question. Right? You're from India, right? You asked me a question earlier. You're from India, right? You asked me a question earlier. What's happening in India? Are Muslims killing others? Is the question the gentleman asked. Now he's afraid. Are Muslims? My dear friends. Who knows the answer to this very simple primary school question? Are Muslims killing non-Muslims across the world? What is the answer? Yes. They are. Yes. Where are the Muslims? I will answer. Why? Why? Uh, why? Are you? Are you specially confused? No. No. Why should you answer? Everyone knows the answer already. Are Muslims killing non-Muslims across the world? Yes. Every single day. What's happening in Pakistan? What's happening in Afghanistan? What's happening in Nigeria? What's happening in Armenia? What's happening even in the UK? My dear friends, I, I don't know if you're aware. Islam, Islam has been officially declared to be a mental illness.